In this video, you will learn how to use the advanced Find feature to search for folders and jobs based on specific search criteria, and how to use the Update feature to perform a mass update on multiple jobs. You can use the Find and Update features to update folders and jobs to move between environments to promote jobs from one environment to another, perform a mass update on fields and values from multiple jobs and folders simultaneously, and update multiple job attributes to adhere to new site standard rules. Let's assume in your organization, your workflow standards are to define and test folders and jobs before running them in a production environment. After you complete testing, your folder and job definitions need to be updated to be used in the production environment where your jobs will run. Let's see how we can achieve this using the Find and Update features. First, we would like to identify all folders and jobs in the testing environment that we want to update. The Find feature enables you to search for folders and jobs by a job attribute, such as job name or application, and gives you the ability to narrow down your search to a specific value by using different operators. In the Find tab, from the Select Attribute dropdown, we are going to select Application. To help us narrow down our search to a specific value, we have a list of operators. In this case, we will select Like and type in Billing AWS. Click Find and view all the folders and jobs that are under the Billing AWS application in the Find Results tab in the bottom pane. You can save the Find criteria as a preset for later use. If you have a set of search criteria you use often, it is best to save it as a preset. After we have viewed and confirmed the folders and jobs, now, we would like to update them with the production environment definitions. In our testing environment, we want to change the host on which they reside to the one where our production environment resides. Let's see how we can achieve this using the Update feature. In the Update tab, click Update and select Update Where. The Update Where function enables you to find a specific value and assign it with a new value. From the Select Attribute drop-down list, select Host slash Host Group. From the Operators list, we are going to select Like and type the testing host name, Test Host, and assign it a new value, the production host name, Prod Host. This will enable you to move the testing jobs from the testing host to the production host. Let's also assume that in your organization, the testing and production jobs contain prefixes in the job name to differentiate between the jobs that run on different environments. Testing jobs consist of a pattern test and job name, and production jobs consist of a pattern PRD and job name. Since we are moving the jobs from testing to production, we also need to update the job names. In this case, we are going to click Update and select Update Where. From the Select Attribute drop-down, select Job slash Subfolder Name. Then select the Starts with Operator and type Test. Now, from the second Operators list, select Replace Prefix from Test to PRD. This will replace the prefix in the job name from Test job name to PRD job name. In our testing environment, we were running jobs as a different user than the user in the production environment. So, we also need to update the run as job attribute. To do so, we are going to add another update criterion and select run as from the attribute list and assign it as PRD user. You can save the update criteria as a preset. Now, we would like to apply our changes. We have several options as to where we would like to apply the update. As you can see, we can apply the update to the entire workspace, selected jobs and folders in the workflow, or update all find results. In this case, we would like to apply the update on the jobs that use the billing command we found earlier using the find feature. Click Update and view the update results in the bottom pane. To confirm the updated definitions, View the Jobs definitions in the Job Properties pane. 